Well, this voice has been coming through the North Mississippi Airways for more than four decades. But after next week, a longtime disc jockey will be signing off. Ellie Martin caught up with Stan Allen during a break from his on-air duties and has more from the award-winning radio personality. For more than 40 years, he's been a familiar voice on radio across North Mississippi. 104.3 in your afternoon. Stan Allen started his radio career at WCPC in Houston, Mississippi, after serving his country in the U.S. Army. At WCPC, he was featured in The Group, students from Ole Miss who showcased their singing and dancing skills. In fact, Allen was the first black member of The Group. From there, the station manager recruited Allen to work an on-air shift, and he never looked back. I had no intention. I never thought about it. Um, you know, God had a plan. After WCPC, Allen worked at stations throughout North Mississippi, Arkansas, and Memphis before coming back to Tupelo, eventually landing at the Pulse. In 2001, Allen battled and eventually beat cancer. However, his cancer and the treatments left him hearing impaired. But that didn't stop him from inspiring listeners, playing the hits, and meeting newsmakers, artists, and faithful fans. I think music is power, mm -hmm. and I'm enjoying it. God has blessed me. I, I, um, I enjoy the people, and you know, it, it, it's a blessing to be able to enjoy it. Just being in this business all of these years, and the, the overall thing is, I thank God for just giving me an opportunity to just be here and express the, um, the fun, the right. excitement of music. Through the years, Alan has won numerous awards and accolades, and now, at 64 years of age, he says it's time to slow down. I want to take some time with my wife, right. uh, my grown children, they're right. older, and uh, I want to take some time for me. While he will be missed on the airwaves, Alan wants everyone to know that he will still be around and part of the community he has called home all his life. I love you all. Thank you so much. Telling your story in Tupelo, Allie Martin, WCBI News. Congratulations, and Allen's final day on air will be next Friday. A reception honoring his work and contributions to the community takes place Tuesday evening at Char Cutie on Clayton Avenue in Tupelo.